Winco will pay a $3.6 million settlement for a class action lawsuit stemming from hidden clean energy surcharges is the headline. In reality, I think it's just one store or their chain of stores in Portland. Basically, Mm -hmm. they were doing a 10 cent energy surcharge that they didn't really tell people about. Oh. And you know I'm a huge fan of Winco. Yeah. So my attitude is who cares? I mean, I kind of get it. Sure. And uh, like, here's the thing. At the end of the day, if you're taking my money, I better know why. Right. And also like, but it's Winco. Yes. <laughs> Completely agreed. Yeah. I have I have a, I remember Winco. Who remembers this? I remember Winco when they were originally Wearmart, mm. way out on the Northgate Mile across the street from the Sugar Shell. Wow. How's that? Oh, I know the building. Next, if you're not familiar with Club Shay Shay, which is a very popular podcast by one Shannon somebody or other. Oh, the football guy. Yeah, the football guy. Yeah. He had one of the first memes of 2024 was he had Cat Williams on. Yes. And Cat Williams got a little, uh, he got a little Hennessy'd up and started bagging on Cedric the Entertainer uh-huh. and Steve Harvey and th- that whole club. Kevin Hart? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think. What? Yes, I think yeah. so. Yeah. Okay. So also, was it Hennessy or was it Crown? It was Hennessy. Okay. Crown was Polly Shore, who uh, did okay. the most brilliant parody <laughs> mm-hmm. of Cat Williams' meltdown. <clears throat> Honestly, this could bring Polly Shore back in my mind. He's right. back. He's he's so good at it. Oh, in fact, he is back, right? Yes. Yeah. He's actually gonna be playing Richard Simmons in a new biopic. About him, which Richard Simmons is not okay with, by the way. Yes, it's unauthorized or whatever. Yeah. The producers say they're going to respect his privacy, but are going to move forward with the project anyway. So, Which sounds a lot like not respecting their privacy. But don't (laughs) you- It feels a little like, I'm not touching you. Right, (laughs) right. (laughs) But doesn't Polly Shord look just like Richard Simmons? I mean- as soon as I saw that bit, <laughs> uh, I was like, oh my gosh, what is Richard Simmons doing here? And then Polly Shore's voice came out. I cannot wait yeah. for the movie. Can't yeah. wait. Yeah. Well, and especially because my cousin and I loved Richard Simmons when we were kids. Did you sweat to the oldies? We did. Yeah. Okay. First of all, you know I'm an old soul anyway. All right. But um, so one thing that we would love to do is we'd watch his workout videos. <laughs> and the, the one that always stuck out to us was he does this line where he's like, wash the windows, wash the windows, get the little ones, get the little ones. And also, you know how you're he, waving for the people that can't see you're waving your hands yeah, in front of you. Yeah, you do like, um, you know, larger circles and then smaller circles for the little ones. Wow. OK. Yeah. Anyway. What a memory. <laughs> right, right. I, I honestly <clears throat> couldn't stand the guy, but I certainly recognized, you know, I would, if he was on the TV, I'd switch the channel, but I certainly <laughs> recognized his place in the pop culture pantheon. Oh, right. Yeah. Absolutely. You know, as a matter of fact, my cousin uh, actually had a pair of little shiny green shorts that she'd wear all the time. And everyone in the family called them her Richard Simmons shorts. Oh, okay. Which, yeah, you can instantly picture probably a green that straight out of the Barbie movie. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Like, honestly, I think that that's what uh, Ken wears during the um, roller skating scene. <laughs> and I want to take back a little bit. I I loved Richard Simmons when he was talking. Right. Because he was a little bit catty, honey. Yeah. You know? He was good. I think he and Joan Rivers did some stuff together. I I vaguely, vaguely remember that. When he was like, work it, go for it, move your arms. I was like, mm-hmm. click. Maybe right. it's exercise that I don't like. <laughs> you know what? That actually tracks. <laughs> I get that. I don't like exercising either. I, I have to feel like I'm doing something productive in order to exercise and running on the like running on the treadmill doesn't feel productive. It feels a lot like I'm, I don't know, what's a good metaphor? Uh, running in place. Yes, right. You like to run... Uh, outside and stuff. I mean, you like yeah. to run two places oh. instead of running in place. Yeah. But I can't wait to see the wheeze. Wheeze in the juice. Remember Encino Man? No. Okay. No. Um, Brendan I actually Fraser. never saw Encino Man. Pa- what? I know. I know. Oh, you'd love Brendan Fraser back in the day. If you I loved the whale, love- if you liked Brendan Fraser in the whale, <laughs> you'll love Brendan Fraser in Encino Man. <laughs> I mean, I saw him in the mummy. Okay. Do you understand yeah. how many people became bisexual because of that <laughs> yes. movie? The entire cast was just super hot. Oh, gorgeous. <laughs> Every single one. Just hot. 